Royal weddings are some of the most lavish events that occur in any part of the world. Anytime a royal wedding is held, millions of dollars are spent on superb wedding dresses, expensive jewelry, catering, and other colorful displays. The wedding of Princess Azima Nimatul Bolkia of Brunei to Prince Bahar Ibni Jeffrey Bolkia of Brunei was not an exception to this culture. The wedding lasted for several days and hosted some of the most iconic festivities ever. If you're curious to know how this wedding went, stick around to find out. Princess Azima Nimatul Bolkia of Brunei is the eighth child and fifth daughter of Sultan Hazanal Bolkia of Brunei. She was born on the 26th of September, 1984, to the Sultan and his former second wife, Juan Mariam Binti Abdul Aziz. Beginning 2023, Princess Azima wedded her first cousin, Prince Bahar Ibni Jeffrey Bolkia, the son of Prince Jeffrey Bolkia of Brunei, in a series of colorful ceremonies at the Istana Nurul Ayman Palace in Bandar Seri Begawan in early January. Princess Azima is a very popular figure in Brunei, and she is a well-accomplished athlete. She made her debut on the Brunei national polo team in 2017 during the Southeast Asian Games in Kuala Lumpur. That year, her team came third in the tournament and received bronze medals and a cash reward. In 2019, she played in the Southeast Asian Games in Kaladigan alongside her famously handsome brother, Prince Mateen of Brunei. That year, they also finished third in the tournament. Princess Azima regularly attends charities organized by her father and other national events. Also, the princess promotes health-related activities to create awareness in her country. Princess Azima's siblings include the late Prince Azim, Princess Fadzilla, and Prince Mateen. Prince Azim tragically passed away in 2020 from an illness. He was known for being an international jet setter and was regularly photographed portraying with big names like Michael Jackson, Lindsay Lohan, Misha Barton, and Paris Hilton. In 2009, Princess Azima played alongside her sister, Princess Fadzula, for the Ivy League during the Sesha Motors Netball Open Championship at the Hazanal Bolkia National Sports Complex. On December 1, 2021, an announcement was made by the Association of Southeast Asian Nations, or ASEAN, and in the announcement, Princess Azima was among the 10 sports ambassadors selected to promote gender equality in preparation for the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. Unlike the princess, much is not known of her groom, Prince Bahar Ibn Jeffrey Bolkia. However, he is the first cousin of the princess and the son of Prince Jeffrey Bolkia of Brunei, who is also a member of the House of Bolkia, the ruling royal family of Brunei Darussalam. Now, the Brunei royal family knows how to make a statement when it comes to weddings. As a year earlier, in January 2022, Princess Fadzala got married to her husband in a ceremony that lasted for days and cost nearly $20 million. In the same manner, the Sultan spared no expense in giving his daughter Princess Azima a grand wedding ceremony. In line with Brunei's royal wedding traditions, the celebrations lasted several days and cost millions of dollars. The ceremony was held at the Istana Nurul Ayman Palace, the Sultan's official residence, which holds the Guinness record for the largest palace in the world. The palace boasts of having 1,788 rooms, 257 bathrooms, five opulent swimming pools, and a huge garage that can house up to 110 cars. The wedding feast began on January 11th with the Istiadat Burbadek Pengaten Diraja, which is the royal powdering ceremony at the Balai Singhasana in Dera Buana in the Istana Narul Ayman Palace. Next was the wedding rites, which was performed at the Ali Saifudian Mosque. The wedding banquet followed, and it started with a magnificent entrance by the royal guards bearing ceremonial shields and swords in the palace hall, which has the capacity of accommodating up to 5,000 people. The bride and groom were decked in matching outfits that were decorated with diamonds and other gems from head to toe. The following evening, there was the Majlis Persantifan de Raja reception for the Princess Azima and Prince Bahar Bolkia at the Istana Nurul Ayman Palace, which was also attended by the Brunei royal family and other royal guests. Princess Azima wore an ivory crystal embellished gown with a matching veil for the wedding ceremony. Her second outfit was a charcoal gray gown 
that was decked with an impressive diamond necklace featuring three teardrop stones as the centerpiece. Among the tiaras worn by the princess during the festivities was the spectacular diamond heart tiara belonging to her stepmother, Queen Saliha. Among the guests was the Sultan's first son, Prince Mateen, who is regularly on the list of the world's most eligible royals. Prince Mateen is also an athlete, and he has a huge following on Instagram. Also among the notable guests was Princess Amina Maimuna, Iskandaria of Johor and Dato Denis Muhammad Abdullah, who joined the Brunei royal family to celebrate the union. This wedding might seem too extravagant in the eyes of normal people, but it is nothing when the bride's father is one of the richest men in the world. Sultan Hassan al Bolkiah of Brunei is currently worth $28 billion, and he sure knows how to use that money. He is the 29th and current Sultan and Yang di Pertuan of Brunei, as well as the Prime Minister of the small southeastern Asian country. After Queen Elizabeth II, Sultan Hazanal is the second longest reigning monarch in history. Unlike most other monarchs that hold only ceremonial powers, the Sultan possesses real power and authority in his country. He was born on July 15, 1946 in Istana Jerusalem in Bandar Seri Begawan and was immediately made the Crown Prince of Brunei. The Sultan received his high school education at Victoria Institution in Kuala Lumpur. In 1967, he graduated from the Royal Military Academy Sandhurst in the United Kingdom. Hazan al Bolkia became the Sultan of Brunei on October 5, 1967, when he was just 15 years old after his father abdicated the throne. When Hazan al Bolkia became the Sultan, Brunei was already ridiculously wealthy thanks to its rich oil and gas reserves. There have been some familial conflicts, one of which was, for example, a feud between him and his brother Prince Jeffrey Bolkia. The two were involved in a serious legal conflict that eventually ended in 2006, so the wedding between their children can be seen as a way to strengthen the ties between the two brothers. Sultan Hazanal owns several hotels, including the Beverly Hills Hotel in Los Angeles, the Dorchester in London, and Le Maurice in Paris, among others. The Sultan is also a huge fan of cars, as he reportedly owns the world's largest car collection. Sources say the Sultan owns anywhere from at least 3,000 to 6,000 cars, including a gold-coated Rolls-Royce. The total value of his car collection is estimated at $5 billion. As if that's not enough, the Sultan of Brunei owns a Boeing 747 for his use, as well as the theme park called Jeradong Park. That is why the Sultan spared no expense in his daughter's wedding. If he can spend all this money on only properties, then it is nothing to spend a few millions on his beautiful daughter and her wedding ceremony, which will surely go down in history as one of the most lavish weddings in the world. Now, meet the women who could surely have such great weddings too. Click on this video to see who are the richest women in history.